Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Sea Slurp, Slurpin' Saturdays, starting and ending the trip here in Seattle, Washington. I'm back! But this time, the new Mama Sad, Mom, Mama Sad, <laughs> Momo Sad Robin is open, and I'm so excited to try this. Obviously, if you're a fan of the original Iron Chef, Chef Morimoto opened his own ramen shop here that you can find right in Seattle. You can also find it in other places in the States as well. They opened two locations in Hawaii. They're all over in New York City. I'm excited to try some Iron Chef ramen. Are you? Let's go ahead and get started. I went ahead with the Yu, what is it? The Yukatsu, which is a seven hour braised beef ramen, which I'm really excited for. There's lots of classic options. There's Suke Man, which is my second choice, but I was like, no, this beef one sounds really amazing. And then we also had um, the option to make it a bit more spicy since everything here is controlled. We got the spicy Yuzu ball, and of course, I loaded mine up with a lot of fresh garlic. Lots of great options here that you can choose from. Skewers, soft shell crab. We got some mango lemonade to get it all started. He's a bit of a stir. <laughs> but yeah, lots of great options. Space is huge. We're catching a game here at CenturyLink Field, which is what a lot of people are doing here today. It's probably a spot to check out, but I'm not going to say anything until I try the new, so I cannot wait to get to my belly. Alright, we got our new hot soup here. So we got a nice seven hour braised beef on the bone. We got my YouTube spice bone here, Akitama, fresh sheep, cut garlic in here. Tons of scallions, a bit of black pepper, kale, which is Texas style. We got our nori and corn. Our noodles in here. We're gonna mix it all up. Apparently, this spice bomb is supposed to be literally like a bomb. So we'll see how it goes. So I'll try a little bit right now without it. Mm. Beefy, beefy. Oh, that ramen is so good. Yum. If you like beef, you'll enjoy it. We're gonna mix it up. Look how red this broth is. I can't wait to get the garlic in there. Yeah, and they do run out of quantities in this one. This one is limited. I came during opening, so be sure to get your hands on that. Let's try it with the spice. There's a lot of spice in this, but pretty mild. It's just pretty spicy, but. We asked for the chili oil because we love the spice. A little drizzle. Let's try the noodles. I'm scared to be wearing white today. Probably a mistake. We got our noodles here. to no heat. I think the Yutsu ball will add a lot of spice to it. 
And I was surprised at the lack of nuttiness that you she found in Dan Dan noodles. There's no spicy peanuts on top or no no apparent sesame paste that I can taste, but maybe that's just the way it is. If you like this video, don't forget to like, rate, subscribe in the link down below. And don't forget to hit that notification just at the top right hand corner so you don't miss any new videos that are coming out. We'll see you next week. Bye!